In this video, I'm going to show you how to move a list from one Trello board to create a new list on another Trello board. The reason I'm doing this is because I've actually maxed out on my boards on my free account. So instead of having a board separate for my done uh, social media posts, I'm actually combining my current social media ca calendar with my done social media posts, because sometimes it's just good to keep a, a track of what I've been posting, um, the types of posts that I've been posting that so I can make sure I'm, I'm giving a, a good combination of value throughout my social media. And sometimes if a post does really well, then I can make sure, you know, it's obviously something that resonated really well, so I can repost that or change it around a bit and post it for the future. So on this, so you can see here, menopause posts done. I'm just adding done to the end of each of these because um, then I know when they're in my uh, social media calendar that these are my done posts. So I'll just do this. Okie dokie. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. What was that? That was remember posts, wasn't it? Remember posts done. Okay, fine. So I'm just going to show you, this is my social media content calendar. It's a bit messy. I have I need to click the dates on these, but I'm saving these unclicked because that's one of the automations I will share with you in due course. But what I am doing here, you can see I've got my, these are what I, I've scheduled or I've been creating for the last few weeks. And then if we scoot across to the far end of the board, these are my lists that I've just moved across, boot, boot camp posts done, business posts done, inspo posts done, and I'm gonna be continuing to add here. So I'm just gonna go back to this board here. And this is the board that I'm moving those lists from. So if you go up here to the three little dots, you can say move list, and then you choose your board. I'm moving it to my social media content calendar board. And then the position is going to be all the way down to the bottom. So 16, I'm going to move that. And you'll see now on here, it will populate with my menopause posts done. So just to show you one more, activity posts done. I'm going to click there, these three dots at the top of the list. Click move list. I'm going to choose the board, social media content calendar, position 17 move and then you'll see it will pop up here in a second there we go so it means i've got all my my current posts that i'm yet to schedule or that have been recently scheduled and my completed posts here all categorized nicely in one board so it frees up um because i'm using trello much more in my business these days and i want to be able to use it more for my uh training team or to to use as a, a training for my coaches um so i'm <laughs> I'm having to create some space, but you get up to 10 boards on a free account. I've never had to pay for, uh, for Trello. I think it's absolutely fantastic. So I hope you found this helpful. If you want to learn more tips about Trello, check out the playlist on my YouTube channel. And um, I break it down into various uh, tasks and also uh, give you a good overview of actually how to start your own board. So hope that helped.